Hi everyone, my name is Mike Mello, Broker Associate, co-owner at Preferred Real Estate Brokers. Welcome to the Mike and Haley channel. Today we're in Kissimmee, Florida, which is in Central Florida, just south of Orlando, in a community called Cross Prairie. This is a brand new master plan community with three different builders that have over 5,000 homes. So we have Jones Homes, MI Homes, and Meritage. Meritage is the one behind us. They have lots of different incentives. We have great relationships with the sales reps and working with them for my whole career. And they've actually been with Meritage for the whole time. So the incentives they're currently having are something on the interest rate. So if you're concerned about the interest rates, this may be the option for you. So they have buy downs on interest rates to the high fives. But if you wanted to, they have an additional incentive where the first year can be in the high threes, second year in the high fours, third year in the high fives. Now this is in October, 2023, and the census may change at any time. So if you wanna know the current incentives, make sure you give us a call first. My phone number is 407-487-3030. That way I'll be able to talk to the one that, the sales rep at the office that I've worked with for years to ensure that you get the best incentives. So let's talk about the house behind me. It's a four bedroom, two and a half bath home with 2,011 square feet of living. And the price at time of filming is around $425,000. Might be a little bit more, a little bit less, depending on which lot that you buy. So pretty basic homes inside with, uh, they don't have very much options for lot premiums or upgrades. So the price is about the price, a little bit different than some other new builders. So let's go ahead and go inside and show you the home. So as we come up, we have a paved, uh, paved walkway coming up to the front patio. This does have a two car rear entry garage that we'll show you. But of course the covered patio goes all the way along the front and to the front door. So let's go ahead and go inside and show you this home. All right, so welcome into the home. Let's go ahead and close the door behind me. As soon as we come in over to the left, we have the family room. So a little sectional TV on the other side, a couple windows looking out on the front yard and the sidewalk of the community. Then the next area is gonna be the kitchen. So the kitchen has this granite countertops. As we go, we see white cabinets going throughout, a little bit crown molding on the above us as well. As we come through on the center island, we have the dishwasher and our sink. On the other side, the range and microwave. And we have the pantry right here in the corner. So plenty of space for all your dry goods. As we continue going around, the cabinets continue and we have our Whirlpool refrigerator. In front of us is the dining room with a couple windows looking out onto the side yard, currently set up for six people. You do have plenty of space here for eating if you want to use this for a dining room. If we go through this hallway, we go into another flex space. So this is definitely a flex space that you can use however you want. You could make it into an office, you can make it into a living room. They currently have it as like set up as an office. Looks like a couple microphones there. So, you know, if you're doing your media stuff, you can do that here with the window on the side. Um, over to our right, we do have the entrance from the back garage. Let me go ahead and open that up. Let Haley go in there and show you the two car garage. So it gets you an idea. They even have a couch back there. See that? <laughs> so. Um, over to the right, we have a little drop zone with a little shelf and mirror. And then the half bath is right behind me, the toilet and the sink. So everything you need, all the bedrooms of course are upstairs. So before we go upstairs, I wanna show you one more thing, which is the storage area. So the under the stairs, Harry Potter room. So you have plenty of space there for all your seasonal goods. And the stairs is right next door. So let's go ahead and go upstairs and show you all the bedrooms. So follow me this way. All right, so welcome to the second floor of this home. So as soon as we come out, we're met by the loft. So you have a sectional TV here. This is nice because if you have the family, you can have the kids up here playing PlayStation. And of course, all the adults downstairs watching The Walking Dead or whatever you want to watch. So let's go ahead and go down the hallway. As we go down here, we'll show you the bedrooms. This is where three of the bedrooms are. So over to my right is bedroom number two. So, you know, pretty basic bedroom. They've done some colors on the wall of interior designers so you can get an idea of what you can do to spice up a house a little bit instead of having the just neutral white walls. We have the closet right behind me and then of course a window looking out to the side yard. As we continue to go, we have bedroom number three. Bedroom number three is a nice size bedroom. We do have a window looking out on the front yard, closet behind us on the far side of the room. And right next to that is bedroom number four. So all the bedrooms are really close to each other, but it is split apart from the primary bedroom suite, which is on the other side of the second floor. So bedroom, and of course, the window looking out again on the front yard, and we do have the closet on the far end. So all these three bedrooms has this full bathroom right next to it. So this does get the ceramic tile floors and the white cabinets, and of course, the really nice countertops, a couple mirrors, toilet, and the tub, and the tile on the tub. So that is those three. So follow me this way if, oh wait, one more. We have a linen closet, so where you can put all your towels. So if you enjoy watching this or you're thinking about buying or selling anywhere in the state of Florida, make sure you like and subscribe to our channel. Both me and Haley would appreciate it as we pass the loft area. And over to our left is our laundry. So ceramic tile floors, washer and dryer, pretty basic setup. Put some shelves in here, be good to go. And as we go through, we're in our primary bedroom suite. 
So this is the primary bedroom with a king size bed, couple end tables on either side. You do have a window looking out. So this will look out onto the back of the home. So you have everything that you need. Actually, that's the front of the home. I had everything mixed up. Everything there was the back of the home. This is the front of the home. Sorry, it's a bungalow. I got that mixed up in my head as I was walking through. So I forgot what I said, swooped them around. All right, so let's go ahead and uh, show you what else we have. If we go this direction, we have the walk-in closet. So a good size walk-in closet for a primary bedroom suite. And then the bathroom, which is a little bit on the small side for a primary bedroom suite, but it sort of works out. We have the white cabinets, the countertops, dual sinks, of course the mirrors. On the far side, we do have a water closet. And then on this side, we have the shower. So that is this house. If you're interested in getting more information on this house or any house within Essential Floor, if you want us to send current listings that are available on the resale or new home market, make sure you just give us a call. My phone number is 407-487-3030. If you don't want to call, prefer a text, that's fine as well. Or you can email us and email will be in the description below. Thank you all for watching. Talk to you next time. Bye-bye.